हेलो एवरी वन माई सेल्फ सोमया तिवारी वेलकम यू ऑल इन माई यूट्यूब चैनल सो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट थोरेसिक वर्टिब्रा सो लेट्स सी अबाउट सम बेसिक फीचर्स ऑफ थोरेसिक वर्टिब्रा सो एज यू ऑल नो थोरेसिक वर्टिब्रा इज प्रेजेंट बिटवीन सर्वाइकल वर्टिब्रा एंड लंबर वर्टिब्रा एंड देर आर टोटल नंबर इज ट्वेल्व देर आर टोटल ट्वेल्व थोरेसिक वर्टिब्रा प्रेजेंट इन आर बॉडी now it is the only vertebra thoracic vertebra is the only vertebra that supports the rib and along with ribs and sternum it forms thoracic cage which is helpful in protecting uh, your vital organs like your heart and lungs now let's have some features of thoracic vertebra so it is heart shaped body it has heart shaped body and it has presence of demi facet and costal facet it has spinous process which is long and slant inferiorly so thoracic vertebra is divided into two typical and atypical vertebra so the vertebra ranging from t2 to t9 is typical vertebra and uh t1 uh t10 t11 and t12 are atypical vertebra so let's talk about demi facet and costal facet so here in this diagram of thoracic vertebra you can see that demi facet is present on the body of thoracic vertebra so this is the demi facet which is present on vertebral body and it articulate with the head of ribs now costal facet so this is a costal facet which is present on the transverse process this is a transverse process and this is a spinous process you can see clearly so costal facet is present on transverse process which articulate with the tubercle of ribs so let's see the superior view and the lateral view of thoracic vertebra so here is the superior view as you can see this is the body of thoracic vertebra here is the spinous process here is the transverse process the pedicle and the lamina and there are two types of costal facet present on the thoracic vertebra so transverse costal facet which is present on transverse process and superior costal facet so let's see lateral view of thoracic vertebra so here is a lateral view so as you can see there is a superior costal facet which articulates with the head of its own rib there is a inferior costal facet which articulates with the head of its below rib and the transverse costal facet which articulates with the tubercle of its own rib here is a superior articular process which articulate with the above vertebra and here is the inferior um articular process which articulate with the vertebra of lower lower vertebral body now let's discuss about atypical thoracic vertebra so t1 has superior costal facet which articulate with first rib inferior costal facet is incomplete in t1 vertebra and basically it is demi facet for second rib now the spinous process of t1 vertebra is long and horizontal and the resemblance of t1 vertebra is like cervical vertebra now moving to t10 vertebra so it has single complete superior costal facet and it doesn't have inferior costal facet coming toward t11 so it has complete superior costal facet and it has absence of transverse costal facet and inferior costal facet so t12 vertebra has only complete superior costal facet on its pedicle and t9 has only superior costal demi facet 